Let's follow the ferret as he scours throughout Somerset searching for hidden history. Morning world. I uh, just thought I'd uh, nip out for a couple of hours on this uh, bit of pasture we've got here. Um, that's hammered, one hammered, one Roman, a couple of medieval bits and pieces. But, uh, grass is nice and short, but, uh, I'll be working on it. We're going to head up there. Up to the top, up and around the ridge and then back down again. Right, see you at the first hole. There we go, a sick target, first target was a bullet, uh, bullet button. And uh, just got this little musket ball. Let's see if we can zoom in. There you go. Don't look it's hitting, he didn't. Oh well, on to the next. Right, right, so next thing they will come in about 95, about four inches down. A nice big old pot leg. Big, isn't they? To the next. We we'll just dug this up. A bit of lead. I don't know what it is. It's all eight anyway. The back there looks like it's been cast. A pot mend, posh pot mend, yeah. I'll clean them up later and uh, get a photo on there. Yeah. Uh, shot. There you go. On to the next. Well, there's my first target of the day. Uh, first target, first uh, coin of the day. Let's zoom in. It's probably better out of the sunlight, actually. There you go. He's 10p. The old 10p. Never mind, it's a coin. On to the next. Oh, I just had that had this about oh, four inches down. Nice little buckle down it. There you go, isn't it? Oh, on to the next. Another target. We've got a nice little buckle there, look. So, isn't it? Right, on to the next. Oh, we've just had this target, he's probably a good seven or eight inches down. He was down in that hole there. Come over and have a look at this. It's a stonker. Nice chew to close fastener there, look. That's the second one out of this field. Let's bring it closer, there we go. Look at that. Let's turn him over. Nice, very nice. It's worth waiting for. On to the next. 
I'll just come over to uh, another field next door. Uh, dug this about eight inches down. So you can see that there. Look. Nice picky bun head. Nice patina on it, but um, unfortunately there's no date. Oh well, there's coins in this one as well. On to the next. Oh, we've got a deep one here. I don't know if you had to see that down there, but there's your pinpointer. Which is... Yep. It's down there, look. See them? Let's go and get him. Towards the second, is he? Come a bit of clean up and get back to you. Yeah, I'll give him a bit of a clean. He's, uh, he's George the second. So, not a lot of detail left on him, but. Never mind. Second coin in five minutes at this one. So, looking promising. On to the next. Right, the coins are a bit deep down this field, I don't know if it's been ploughed or not, but I had to dig a hole inside a hole there, down, down there. Anyway, put the sod out. I'm not too sure, but that looks a bit round and silver to me. Let's go and have a look, shall we? It's been a pendant, but uh, definitely looks silver. Yeah. Oh well, a bit of silver. On to the next. Just have another target. That's a nice old button. A Tudor rose on it. Let's pop him out. He cleaned up all right, wasn't he? Cool. On to the next. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you.